少々名の知れたトレジャーハンターここメキシコの南部に千年の時を経たコアトリクエの像があると判明したのが2週間前旦那冷やしたぜNeed to get the iPad going a second. So, uh, who needs Evans? 
It's one of the games I had with my uh, Mega CD, this was. Bit of a cheesy game, but it's got some cool music. Fun though, it's quite a fun game to play. For what I remember. Might be terrible now. Uh, Right, my live That's the question. Looks like I am. Hang on. Hey, if you like then, let's go, mate. Cheers for joining. Oh, turn my iPad down so I can hear myself. Get some more Mega CD in, I reckon. Why not? Yeah, it's all right. It's a bit cheesy, Ernest Evans, and it's a, it's a bit weird with the gripping and he's multi-limbed and stuff, which is a, a little bit odd. But uh, I don't know, it, it was quite a fun game at this time, even though they did a, a cartridge version of this, and it's pretty much the same, even with a nice little skull zooming in and out effects and stuff. So. Sure. I did quite enjoy playing this. <laughs> right, cool. Quite like the music in this game. Music's cool. It's a bit weird. You got You can duck down, and you can walk like that, and you can you can roll. It. That's a bit. It's, the, c the controls on this game are a little bit janky. Hand grip on them as well. They um, they made a sequel to this essentially. Well, it's not a sequel as such. It's a follow-on game, and that's uh, oh, what's it called? Um, Elevento. It's the same. It's the same universe essentially. Elevento was uh, not a bad little game, a little bit messy as well, actually, but... Hey, Bill, we're right, mate? How's it going? Welcome back. I've just noticed something, hang on. <laughs> I think the TV is stretching the image slightly. I bet it's turned out in game mode again as well, haven't it? It's about to have. No, we're in game mode. Um, oh, just scan his defy on. Auto. Hmm, defy stretched a little bit too much. Oh well, don't mind. I'll live with it. Yeah, I'll live does. It's not a bad little game either. I know he's very grippy. I'm going to stay in the safe spot and kill him. Which might take a while, actually. Okay, he's dead. Oh, I forgot. Sleeping potion. Great. Why would they put a sleeping potion in this game? Come on, bat. I, I can't remember what you got to do to open that door. The switch, maybe.
Oh, great, I'm going to have to get back up here now. Like I said, controls are slightly janky. Ah, that's what I want. You are supposed to be able to grip on them, but it doesn't always do it, as you can see. Got these nice uh, skull things up here. Ooh. I'm alright. Dice survivor. Oh, boss. Oh, damn, I didn't want to go down there. <laughs> cool, I don't know, I think. Nekororo. それは発生期に記されたイムベキコモンジョの名で。Hello. メシメキシスカーティシンジョボレ。自分の目で見たいと言った探求心が俺の心を突き動かしたからだ。だが、ライブスケーパー。どれだけじゃ。ディンディン。イスベットフィニッシュスコリベアクシバ。カウンフィニ
Oh, he's aiming them at me. Um, oh, I didn't want to do that. Get up. Come on. Get up. Get up. Junkie controls. Um, should I try going up here? How do you use our weapon? Ah. Okay, cool. Oh shit, don't like a look at that. Oh, die then. Alright, okay, okay, you're not gonna die. I'm gonna run away. Ernest Evans on the uh, Mega CD. Bit of a cheesy game. I have no idea where I'm going, and I've just rolled randomly for no reason. It's uh, a bit of a cheesy game, but it, it is quite fun to play. It's a sort of prequel to um, Elevento on the Meg Drive. Oh shit. the boss. Yeah, uh, boss, cool. Yeah, it was the game I bought with my uh, Mega CD when I had it. Oh, this this has got some really cool zoom in skulls. Well, sort of zoom in sort of skeleton things, which are actually on the um, Mega Drive version. You can get this game on cartridge as well. The skulls are really cool looking. Quite a nice effect, isn't it? But it's, it's surprising how the Meg Drive one actually looks like that as well. Great, now we've got a weapon that doesn't itch it. That's it, how bad. <laughs> oh, we're dead. Right, this thing's all to aim in by the look of it. Is it weapon? Better idea. Cannot remember the best way to go. I think they shoot you off and make you go flying around. Ooh. That was a bad idea, wasn't it? Hmm, okay. Oh, dead. I should have gone for it. Right, let's use the iframes and get out here. You only got so many continues as well, so it's cool you continue from where you uh, where you died, which is quite handy. I'm stuck with it. Nice. This is probably the way to go.
Ah, it got me. Two credits. Damn it. Hang on, guys. Oi. Daijoka. Shikarishiro. Anatawa. <laughs> Gotta just pop downstairs a second, guys, a minute. Let me skip this. That's, um, Elevendo. We save her in this game. Yeah, I'll, I'll pause this out. I just gotta pop downstairs one sec. Right, back in a minute. Sorry, guys. Right, sorry about that guys, I'm back. Emergency with the TV controls. Batteries run out. Right, let's try again. Ooh.
it's not Elevento in name, is it? It's um, Netta Futabi. Because there's, um, there's a beat-em-up on you. On the Mega CD, on the Japanese one, with, with her in it. We'll have to play that at some point as well. I say, I did have the original uh, up to probably about six months ago, I flogged it. It's called a net again. It's on the PC Engine as well, but the PC Engine one's not as good. You should can whip him as you're running off. Could try it. Oh, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have to get up there. I think. I can't get any. <laughs> that was quite funny. Right, where the hell have I got to go? Right, chaos. Who? Right, I don't think I've got to go back. Oh, hang on. That's unfortunate for them too, isn't it? He's lovely placed on the end of his gun. So probably needed to go up here. Right, okay, cool. Do 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 do. Yeah, her name's Aneta Futabi. I think it's Futabi. Something like that. Jeez, don't know what that is. It looks like I might have to kill it. Ooh. Oh shit. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Right, getting close to it is probably the best idea then. Cool, we got it. Stage is nice and uh, short. Oh, I got Tinny Heidi Mashtaka. Wanga family, you are Makunirna. It taught all it all. Yeah, yeah. What that you are, Saishukara Shinda is the only Mashta. My Shkash, three new Wanga ten euro pony near Shina Kitaka. Kanga Ibukakumarna, her can cry sing it. この猫の巫女を散らすかせれば、それも簡単なことかと切り止まりのヨーロッパ。They have to yeah, let's get by then. Just look at a wall. There she is, look, in her car. Again, in, uh, in behind them is a good idea. Music's cool in this stage. I think all, everyone does a chicken walk, which is quite funny. The head goes back and forth. Which is quite funny. They do it as well. I 
I go. Yep, Zard is early as um, all doing this event. Oh, oms. Oh God, that was fast. Probably gonna have to try and beat this there with me. <laughs> Let's plant some dynamite. Everything is solid. Ah, set game over. Let's have a double go, Ashley. Mm, should we turn them off? Turn them off. Be quicker loaded. Not as much load in mine, but. Right. This game does have cool music. And get up there. I'm sure you can force it. Oh well, just go around. Oh. Right, this is where I need to go up. Oh, I fell right down. Ah, great. Ah, can get up here, I thought so. There's no always grip on there, that thing, see? Like I said, funky controls. Oh, I did. And then... <laughs> I keep thinking I'm going to miss it. Oh, come on, jump. Oh, you... Right, this is going terrible. I don't want to go around. Right, uh, come on. We can definitely get a bit because we just did it. Yeah, alright, let's just go around. Kill this guy now. What are you doing? Come on. Right, 
Alright. Alright, let's try again. Struggling with that jump now. Come on, jump. Oh, I can't believe why we're struggling with this jump. Right. Ah, we're gonna have to start again over again. That's pretty crappy. Let's try again. Gotta do a better going now, that's terrible. Oh. Should try to reset button, shouldn't I? Team created staff, wolf team. Wolf team would basically tell Net Japan. Or part of Tell Net Japan. Um It's never made anything really exceptional, but I do quite like the games. They made the Valis series. We like the Valis series. Even though they're not exactly the best games in the world, but <laughs> right, see if we can do the, the skip. I can definitely do it. Ah, oh, nearly. Uh, it's quite tricky to do. I'm not sure, probably. I'm sure there's only one wolf team. Could be wrong, mind. If that wolf team were part of Talon Japan. Just go up this way. It's tricky grabbing on the stuff, it really is. Weird if the screen is scrolled down, he doesn't actually hit it. Come on, die. Don't want to hit the sleeping potion. Definitely doing some awkward patterns. Oh no. Oh, come on, jump, 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 jump. Right. 
right, okay. Come on, jump. Sometimes doesn't jump. Oh, I didn't want to go down yet. Can I just climb out here? Oh. They're definitely making it awkward in here. There we go. Put out. Definitely much easier if you got that jump. Oh. We gotta go down here, don't we? Uh -huh. Fight him with the controls. You should know how to kill this thing this time. God, that's a lot of bees. through my head. Um, did we jump across here last time? I think we did. It's just definitely the way we went. No window near somewhere in there. Oh, what? Ah. Those enemies take a fair amount of energy off you if they actually hit you. down last time. I'm sure we went this way. Yeah, we did. Right, I've got to get in close to it. We 
You got it. again. <laughs> Quite powerful that weapon. You're gonna get so many uses as well, but look at it. Did we go this way? God, it kicks his ass. Alright, okay, cool. Oh, that was better. Um, okay. Ah. Couldn't do much about that then. Stop me right back as well. Come on. He is random then. Down, 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 down. Cool, he's dead. So I definitely need to get up on top of the train. Right, so. Oh no, 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 no. Gotta crawl for the train. Someone told me to do it. Dun, dun, dun. I can hit him from here. What do you want to expect now? The hell's wrong with his calves? Shins and his calves look ruined. It's weird. Eh? Looks like his flesh uh, tore off him. He didn't do as good this time. All right, so you definitely need to get close to this. Oh, not where the hell are you going? Stop. <laughs> okay. Head first into the wall, shall we? 
Here we go. <laughs> Solid. They're not too bad to deal with. Yep, some swords off a building, I'll do. Stupid. I'm going to kill him. I'm not sure if Talat Japan and both teams are still around. Oh, so I collect the last bullet. wonder if they are the same team. Jumping into that like I was probably a bad idea. The energy uh, got ruined then. Go on, jump. You gotta watch, you push into a wall or something, he, he doesn't jump. Oh, I tried to jump over it. It was a bad idea. Yeah, the music's cool. Uh, so, we'll go back. I'll show the um, the other game. Uh, net again. Uh, net for Tubby. This is the girly rescues. The one that's in Elevendo. If it works, of course. Which doesn't look like it does. I did rename that folder. Which is probably a bad idea. Okay. Can I just open that folder? Um, open folder. Uh, which is which? Q file. I think the folder needs to be exactly the same name as the game. Then again, looks like this game doesn't work. Ah, that's a shame. <coughs> ah, that's a shame that one doesn't work. Ah, it's a it's a basically a scroll long beat up. It's quite nice. Let's try running the just the plain image. No, I won't. Uh, we'll run the sub. No. No, it's got to be the Q. Yeah, it's a shame it don't work. Ah. Um. All right. Anything you want me to try, guys? Or we can play shoot 'em up or something. I don't mind. Dark Wizard. Uh, it's supposed to be a very good game. That's a strategy game though, so might be a bit awkward to play. I love Dungeon Explorer, but unfortunately, the Mega CD version you've got you've got to keep e eating food to survive, which uh, I can't get my head around it. Unless we have another goal in the sevens and see if we can get a bit further. Ah, oh, come on, Ernest, let's do it. Yeah, I'll have to try and find another version of um, Annette again. Solfies, good call. I like Solfies. Solfies. I think, actually, was this Solfies I had with it? It might have been Solfies I had with it. My Meg CD when I bought it. 
It was either that or um, Ernest Evans. It was one of the two. Then again, it was a long time ago. Body arm, yeah, I might have another go with that. I was playing that last night for a bit. That's quite cool. Got a stage five or six on it, I think it was. Created staff. Wolf team. Wolf team. Yeah, it seems quite a cool game, that does as well. This game's got nice music as well. I like the um, the little sort of uh, pieces of metal and stuff flying around. They've got their own sort of. Um, you can push them back. As with space, you can stop their sort of trajectory and push them back. Which is quite cool. Ah. See, so watch out! You can actually push them back, which is pretty cool. You can get this on cartridge as well. It's pretty much the same game. It's called Soldis for some reason on cartridge. This was originally a Sharp X68000 game. Ah, couldn't get the way those bullets in. Okay, this is going really good. We're doing well. Oh, it's my first goes terrible. I don't know why. I've actually got the UK version of this. <laughs> I kept this because it's uh, quite cool. Yeah, it's cool. They sort of like um, got a bit of sort of reaction off the guns as they fire. There's some nice backgrounds and stuff in this game as well. you could go for them. As long as the tip doesn't hit you. Yeah, had me from behind there, that bloody um, arm thing. for those laces quite well. Mm 
and get killed by them? No, we're alright. This will donate. Glad they didn't fire. Alright, I can't remember what this boss is. What does he do? Ah, oh, it's this one. You gotta go this side of it. And back on this side of it. Is a flying level or is like a sun next? I think. Yeah, it is. I need to do a little bit of Thunder Force this level. For Lisa's top and bottom, I think. Stupid. I've seen that come to my off end as well. Uh, stuff in the beginning again. I'm not beginning to continue when I shoot them up, so don't we? Still quite like the sort of one credit clear. Those enemies didn't come down from the bottom this time. Did they though? Ooh, that was, ah, that was nasty. At least they didn't kill me this time. Ooh. Me fell for that then. Powerful that bomb. Is 
I think this game's got seven levels. If I remember rightly. I think it does. So hopefully we can get him this time. Don't wanna die again. Well I didn't die last time, but definitely don't wanna die on him if I can help it. Those last two at the end nearly have me. Type boost noise is quite cool. There are some decent games on the Mega CD. There's a lot of crap mine, but in between that crap, there are some uh, little gems like. It's a shame it came out at the time where everyone thought, ah, oh, full motion video. Yeah, that's going to be big. Everyone's going to want to play full motion video games. Uh, no. motion video games do suck. <laughs> oh, it's probably a really bad idea to allow then. Mess that up. Chat. Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Where everyone said that was the future, and uh, that's a shame. That's what happened to the PC Engine FX. Is they thought like that full motion sort of was the, was the future. No, it sucks, doesn't it? When you play back in it, there's a there's a new um, FMV game coming out for the uh, PlayStation called Gamer Girl, which is a bit crazy. Who wants to buy FMV games now? And actually, there was one free on uh, PlayStation Plus this month. <laughs> I remember buying one or two of them back in the past. I remember thinking uh, I bought uh, D. 
I, I remember getting it home and then thinking, oh my god, what is this shit? And then, since you paid money for it, I was trying to play it. Ah, terrible game. Oh, okay, that was nasty. Oh, oh, oh come on. What was there? Oh, that's, that's, that's great. Come on. No. Just couldn't go for the gap end. Yeah, D was. Uh, my mate loves him, too. He actually loves full motion video games. It's just bizarre. I did play one on the CDI that was actually surprisingly fun. Called uh, Voyeur. It's like an adult version of um, <coughs> Night Trap. But it's just quite funny. Just in sort of like the, um, not the, this is the president, in the president's house, and he's got his missus, and she's like carrying on with everyone, and it's like this murder mystery thing going on. It, it is actually quite an amusing game. The game itself is a bit shit, but it's just you, you find the characters in really funny situations and stuff. But yeah, generally, for most of the games, are a bit deaf. Chad. Yeah, they are. The SJW crowd are a bit nuts on here, to be truthfully honest. Like, I think when they first turned up, they were, they were, they did a bit of good. There probably was a lot of things that needed changing, and they did a lot of good. But now, it's just a use our excuse to go for anything. Now I've probably said that, I'm probably going to be like full of SJWs trying to take my channel down. But yeah, yeah, they're not happy about it. I can, I can sort of see why, but the woman in the, in the actual video, she's the one who wrote it. So, then again, let's be, you know, perhaps the subject is not the greatest thing, but you know, no one complains when things like that are done in movies, so there is that, I suppose. But yeah, they're not happy about that game ago. Let's be honest about game ago. Who's gonna buy it? Can I blow that thing up? Because... I can't imagine it selling that well, to be honest. my last life on it. Oh, that's a bit tricky. Should we have another go or should we try um let's have one more go. It's like the old uh, SJW thing going on about um, Last of Us. She's a lesbian in Last, Last of Us. Who cares? You know, just deal with it. There's lesbians everywhere. You know, it's just part of life, isn't it? 
just got to get on with it. And as much as uh, they've tried to take that game down, uh, it's done incredibly well. So it's crazy though that a team of made it are getting death threats and everything, uh, all sorts of things. That's why some of them has left. How nuts is that? Like over a game, like. Got to be something wrong with you if you're threatening to kill people over a game. It's just like, you know, you need to sort of wake up. Anyway, they got nothing to mourn about. Imagine back in the day when you bought E.T. for the tie 2600. Jesus. I think they might have had a reason to kill. <laughs> that game was terrible. I remember having that ET on a Pi twenty six hundred years ago, and I just remember putting it on, thinking, "What the hell do you do in this game?" I literally did have no idea what to do on it. See if we can kill this thing quick again, like last time. Right, so you can stay in front of it. Oh, no, don't. <laughs> so they, they, they're they up in arms about Ghost of Tsushima as well, they? Well, that is supposed to be a pretty, a pretty decent game. It's amazing, isn't it? How they'll um, they'll pick on one game and want it cancelled and give you bad reviews. This is why you can't really trust any user reviews on the internet anymore. Um, but then <laughs> they'll latch onto another game, even if it's not the greatest game in the world, and then they'll make it like it's the best thing in the world. Ghost of Tsushima does look pretty good, though. I'm not massively into open world games. I prefer more like, you know, these type of, like, small arcade sort of stuff. Open world games don't interest me quite so much. Well, my mate's playing it at the moment, and I, I've, he usually gets rid of his games pretty quick, so I, I said to him, uh, once, he's had, once he's had enough of it or whatever, give me a shout. I might pick it up off him. I just love the... Uh, the samurai sort of um, aesthetic of the entire game looks just looks really nice. It does look pretty beautiful, actually. The game. Finally, I've heard the story is not supposed to be the best, even though it's not terrible, but it it's not supposed to be brilliant. But the uh, the gameplay and the fighting and stuff and the and the island exploring and all that is supposed to be really good. Oh come on, bugger off! Ah, that was really stupid. Why did I do that? <sighs> Did get some pretty nice reviews, right? It's on about an 8.4 on IMDb. Um, 
Oh, yeah, MDB uh, Metacritic, which is uh, it's pretty decent. Pretty much means it's a decent game. Oh, I'll have to plug my iPad in in a second. Ten percent. Cool. Let me uh, plug the iPad in. Yeah. Cool. What can you see there? No, the landfill thing, the documentary, it's, it's not particularly that truthful about the entire thing. It makes out that um, they secretly had millions of copies of it or whatever, and they went and buried them in a desert somewhere, and they secretly did it in the middle of the night. And it was just E.T., E.T., E.T. Well, the, the truth of the matter is, it wasn't really like that. It's what happened. They had a video game crash in the, the U.S., and Atari had shitloads of stock in warehouses which was costing them loads of money and they couldn't do anything with it and it was copies of et yes and there was um there was other games in there as well and there was consoles there was hardware there was joysticks and everything and they literally just didn't have the the room for it in the warehouse so they uh they did take it to that uh dump in uh Ala, was it alameda or something it says in texas no not texas um mexico they did take it to the dump, but the only reason they didn't let anyone know that it was going to the dump is because they didn't want anyone to go there and start, you know, going through the dump for equipment. So they just, they just never said anything. They, they just dumped it. So all you'll find in that documentary is they're all looking for ET, but when they when they actually go to the dump and they actually go, oh, I kill me again, and they start finding stuff, they find a bit of everything. Um, I'm going to stay here because I think ah, that bit's really difficult to kill them things. Yeah, so they, they apparently they, they dumped a bit of everything. If you, if you ever watch the um, the Game Historian, he does uh, a little video on it. And he, he's he got some, um, he managed to interview a few, few people who talk about it. But that's what they did, it wasn't just E.T. It was just made out to be E.T. because it made a nice documentary and it made a nice sort of uh, urban legend. Damn, they explode out quite a bit, didn't they? I thought I'd be safe here again, obviously not. It made a good story though, didn't it? Secret dumping of E.T. everywhere, like dump millions of copies of E.T. Apparently they, they did make low <laughs> they made um they they made the stupid mistake apparently of making more E T cartridges than they did actual consoles they sold. Which is a slight over <laughs> oversight for a company to print out loads you know, literally more than consoles you've made. <laughs> Which is a bit stupid really. I bet somebody had a bit of a bollocking for that when they found out about it at a party. Then again, I, I used to... Um, in the job before I had now, I used to work for... A, uh, my boss said to me, he said, oh, when, he, when he used to work on like a parks type department, he said, uh, when I worked on the parks department, he said, um, I spent, um, what was it, 18 grand 
doing this grass verges out next to the side of the road, putting nice flowers in, and uh, it took him about a week to do and all that. And he said um, he forgot to check the works that were going on, and uh, a few days later they dug the verges up and uh, <laughs> and basically uh, concreted them over. He said he he said his boss wasn't particularly too happy when he found out. Yeah, it is a great urban legend. What was the other urban legend about the arcade game that it was uh, people just got stuck in playing there? Was it um, Polybrius? Which is not true either. It only appeared in certain arcades and uh, people like, well, was it like addicted to it? And Ah, you get too close to so you die. Because Alarmasoft uh, made uh, the game as well, didn't they? They they made a game they called Polybius. Ah, it was quite funny. I was at a gaming show once, and Jeff Minter was there because he was the guy who made uh, that that game, and um, he was playing it, and he, he was doing right actually. But I, I could I, I couldn't resist the urge to tap him on the shoulder and go, Ah oh, man, I thought you'd be better at your own game. <laughs> uh, I couldn't resist. Right then, okay, Android Assault. <laughs> People were selling the Atari cartridges and other games and joysticks and consoles from that dump. For stupid money on eBay after. It's like, why <laughs> why would you pay like 800 quid for a, a basically a really dirty, stinky copy of E.T. that's been in a dump, covered in food, crap, shit, whatever. Uh, and it's covered in dust and apparently some of them did work after that. Why would you pay like 800 quid for that when you could go to eBay and buy a copy? I did watch a YouTube video where some guy had paid the money for one, and it was it was a really bad state, as you, as you can imagine, being stuck in a bloody uh, dump the entire time. Um, but he actually cleaned it up and it worked, which is quite shocking. Been in a dump for like twenty odd years, and after that, it worked. This is a five in one. This is damn good. This five in is. Right, the grey one, if I remember rightly, is the one that changes you into the robot and powers you up. So after they uh, did that documentary, the, the local council for um, Alameda, um, they were selling the stuff, a lot of the stuff on eBay, selling for like hundreds and hundreds of pounds from that dump. It was them. They were actually selling stuff. Right, you don't want to get the power-ups because it changes your firing back. Can't fall a bit of 80s rock. That's why Lords of Thunder's got such a fantastic soundtrack. That's actually on this machine as well, Lords of Thunder. It's uh, it's way easier than the PC Engine version. It does have remix music, which is rather nice, but I do prefer the PC Engine's more sort of gritty soundtrack. And the PC Engine one looks better as well. And they did some changes with the, uh, the Mega CD version, made the game a lot easier. But they did improve some of the weapons, because some of the weapons weren't that great on the PC Engine version, but um, pretty much all the weapons do have a pretty good use on the Mega CD one. I did a video on my channel uh, probably a couple of years ago comparing the two of them. I played the one, then played the other one, and I was pointing out all the differences.
But I've never ever seen that. Apparently it did come out in the UK as well, but I've never ever seen that on the Meg CD. If it did come out in the UK, I, I've never seen it. He jumps back. Yep, they were the people. They were they were the ones selling their cartridges. The local, the, the local council was selling them. So they they were stopping people going in the dump for health reasons, as they were saying. They were trying to stop people, but then they were digging it up themselves and chucking them on eBay. I seen an interview with the um, head of the council saying, um, "Oh yeah, if we make some money out of these, we'll make some money back for the." The local sort of user for local amenities in the community, so that's what they'll be doing. It seems a bit cheeky that they were doing it, I don't know why. Then again, some of the councils in uh, UK do. Not, not similar stuff to that, but there's a few of the councils London way that actually uh, they set themselves up with businesses and stuff, and they uh, they make like they shouldn't really be making money to be honest, but they make um, how much was it? it was it was something like fifty million a year. I'm not sure which council it was. It was around London way, and um, they make like fifty million a year because they're running all OAP homes. And they charge in, like private uh, OAP homes, and uh, they run in like local businesses and stuff. <laughs> and all recycling of uh... ooh, oh yeah, it's a bomb in it. Recycling round here sometimes uh, ends up. You got the recycling sort of lorry that comes round, and when they're busy, it uh, it ends up in a landfill. Some of it does occasionally. Oh, uh, how many times can you power this up? I don't want to get that. Ah, uh, I get hit. That's right. As long as I didn't lose this weapon, it's so good. I need to get some power-ups, I think. We've got to go all the way up to level one. <laughs> this fire is well, Andy. Job I didn't get it then. Power up. <laughs> this play quite nice. It's, a, it's got a nice playability, this game. Plays nice and tight.
Am I going to be able to dodge that wave weapon? Ooh, just about. Down, down, down. A little bit of funky guitar going on. <laughs> I was in a band for a couple of years playing guitar. Ended up um, touring in Europe and uh, having songs on the radio and uh, all around the world and stuff, which is pretty nuts. We were, we were quite big on uh, like a load of stations in the US at one point. They were living us. They get invited to a couple of um, radio studios in the US, but uh, I don't think they quite knew where we were. Fun times. Shame it's over, but there you go. That's how it goes. I ruined him really quick for this weapon. Oh no, I crashed. Oh, I kept the weapon on. That's oh, alright. <laughs> he said I didn't lose the weapon. Hello, hello. <laughs> Unfortunately, not. I did, um, <laughs> it's quite funny, this is. We, uh, we ended up in Germany gigging, and uh, they'd given us this like big backstage and stuff where we had everything, showers, food, free booze, all this type of stuff. So, after after we'd done this uh, big gig, there was a big after party, and it was just like, it was full of random people and random women, which you've never met before, as you do. And, um, there was these, these two women, it was like uh, the mother and the daughter, which is pretty random. And we were talking to them, and it was like, um, they were going, oh, where are you from? And I said, and um, we were going, oh, what's your name in? And they were like, Slag. And I was like, Slag? She goes, yes, we're the Slags. <laughs> and and that, was, that was literally their last name. I can't remember their first name, but their last name was Slag, or, or Schlag. <laughs> Uh, we were laughing our heads off. They they didn't know what the hell we were laughing at because they were, they were they were literally the two slags. That was really funny. <laughs> they were a good laugh, like, but um, yeah, fun times, I suppose. The two slags. <laughs> oh, they were quite funny. The two slags. And uh, it's just funny. Uh, the um, the bassist, he was, uh, he was talking. We were, we were talking to these uh, these just random German people who do like and really friendly and stuff. And this one guy was being really friendly to him. And uh, he turned around to him in the night and said, um, he goes, he goes, ah, oh, I like you. And he was like, okay. And he said, I'd like to lick your bum hole. <laughs> and he was serious as well. That's what he wanted to do. And uh, he, he came up to him. He was going. This guy's freaking me out. He's scaring me. He just said he, he just told me what he wants to do to me. I was like, okay, okay. Perhaps you should stop buying him drinks. Uh. <laughs> yeah, he scared the hell out of him, man. He, he just. This guy wanted to do weird things to him. <laughs> I 
This is definitely the best weapon if you can get it and keep it. <laughs> I think he was too scared, but yeah, he just you know he was uh, he was proper freaked out by it as well. Like he was just like, I can't believe he wants to do it. What, what he wants to do to me? And I, I talked to him. He was he was just like, yeah, yeah, yeah I'd love to do that to him. And I was like, okay, fair enough, fair enough. At least you're honest about it. It is, huh? You're not hiding anything there. We did. Uh, <laughs> we we had to stop in France at one point to get um get fuel for the van. And uh, we crashed into a petrol station in France. So that was uh, that was interesting. Swine hit me. <laughs> Funky ZD guitar. Oh no, he's fired. No, no, I died. I could have done with that power up. Oh, I got it. Oh no, it's a wall. <laughs> oh, that was unfortunate then. I don't wanna. Oh. Yeah, I'm on. You have taken your last breath. Prepare to die. At this one, you can power up. Well, that goes to the beam. Ah. Oh. oh, they fire lasers. Laser missiles. Kicks ass if it's uh, Ooh. uh okay, what are they gonna do? This boss is not going well. boss is not going well at all. Oh, he's fine. I'll just fire him normal. Yeah, no worries, mate. Cheers for joining. I don't even know what's the time half ten. I'm alright for five. Yeah, cheers for joining, mate. Uh, might see you again, probably next week. I got to work in the morning as well. Look how I'm still working from home, so it's not too bad. Power up. 
Well, I got I got some people I booked in for nine o'clock tomorrow and ten o'clock, so gonna have to be on the ball. I gotta watch this level because you see those bomb things. They uh, they hurt. Seems a pretty cool game, it does. I like it. Many hits in on that, do charge up. I think, no, yeah, maybe not. It takes probably ages to kill this thing. Ah, <sighs> come on. There's got to be a quick way of doing this uh, this mid boss. Definitely overstays his welcome. Weapon doesn't seem the best for this boss, unfortunately. Yeah. Right, he's dead. <sighs> Explosion nearly having. Ooh. Oh, that's alright. The grey ones are okay. Back now then. <coughs> right, okay. We good. Uh, more of these bombs coming though as well.
Hang on. Scratchy 8. Oh, power up. Right, did I get to this boss last time? I think I might have got to the boss and didn't pass him. Or did I get to the boss? Yeah, I think I did. Too bad so far. These flames are starting to get a little bit of sink in me. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Oh, here's the odd bit then. I like a look at that. Great. This is all new from here on. You haven't got this far before. What was that stage five? Was it? Try the next stage. Nah, no, stage five. That was stage four. Transform. Oh, I did get to this stage last night, actually. I don't think I got very far, now. Ooh, can I make her? Glad that don't kill me. Ooh. Do not want to collect that weapon. Get that though. Power up. Pick a weapon. Oh shit. I love that game, Midnight Resistance. Alright, this is a bit of died on. Pity the Meg Drive version hasn't got that speech there. Pick a weapon. I don't want to get too fast to speed up through this bit, so I end up hitting the bloody wall. Oh, that was a flat wall, then. Definitely getting a bit slow down here. I'm gonna need to kill those bloody old things. If they blow up. Power up. Uh, at least I'm hitting him and I'm getting the orbs, so that's not too bad. Ooh. Say so, now I just got hit. Right. Makes it a little bit easier to dodge in between the uh, lasers. Oh, he's going to be close. Ah, oh, no. Ah, 
I wanted that power up. I thought I'd be able to survive a hit if I had that power up. Obviously not. Ah. Oh well. So not a big fan of continuing on uh, on shrubs. Right in. What should we have a go of next? Um, I'm tempted to have another go of Ernest Evans. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, why can't I see it? There are games on here I've never tried as well. Yeah. I remember the first time I seen that by your screen on my Japanese unit when I had it I was just amazed at all the rotation and stuff it did in creative stuff wolf team that was like every day alright so I'm going to cut the, uh, the visual scenes off Go for it. See if I can do the... Yep. Tricky that is to get up here, like that. I can just go down, can I? Do, 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 do. You scroll that down. It's, it worked last time. Ah, come on. Want to get the sleeping potion? Then again, maybe I will. Yeah, all right, mate. No worries. Cheers for joining. I probably won't stay on for too much longer myself. Right, that was a bit better. Great, join bold in the head. Come on, get up. I gotta go down. I do get any energy back for that. Yeah, I do. Another one needs up here as well. Don't want to fall down in the water again. Nice. Think of it then. Oh, 
Alright, I gotta go down this one. Go on, jump. It's weird, when you push to the left or right and jump, it's half of them he doesn't actually jump. You gotta like let go of the but let go of the D-pad and then jump. It's just like counterintuitive to everything else you would normally do. I'm gonna die now in a minute. Yep. Oh, come on, stop rolling. The playability in this game that sort of challenges you more than the actual game. <laughs> Music school. I do can kill them things. Pretty sure I went. Okay. It's a nasty place to be. Okay, cool, he's dead. Oh, we're doing a little bit better this time. Right, here we go. You kill him before he fires at me? Yes. Oh, gotta get close to this boss. Cool. Diddle down, down, down. Skulls. I right, don't stay too close. Did I go up last time? I can't remember. Don't get my near this weapon, but it is powerful.
It's not a bad way of doing that, actually. Um, I need to get over there, so I need to change. That was just random sometimes, whether... Whether that actually works or not. Wizard guy. I can still hit him. Well, I don't want to die. Oh, he's dead. Get that guy now. What the hell happened to his uh, shins? <laughs> Whoa, but he was trapped then. I should duck out then. Normally stands up, that guy does. Okay. Well, I want to walk right up to this boss and then just duck down. Get up, Ernest. Right, let's come here, ram straight in a wall.
quite an easy boss, that one. This level's tricky. I said I can get it back. Right, these plants coming up are a nightmare. These things. We oh, fight the other way, that was handy. Solid them things. Oh, I thought it wasn't gonna I thought it was gonna stay shut there, and that would have been handy. This is like this level is definitely taken out of uh Nausicaa Valley of the Wind. It's got the same type om bugs. It's got the same like sort of like trees in the ceiling. Somebody must have liked uh, that cartoon, I reckon. It is a damn good uh, movie, mind. remember at all what the boss of this stage is. Oh, there's no boss. That would be why. One big chain. And then, oh, that's it. Stay in our position. That'd be great. That will be fantastic if you're just going to carry on doing that. That was pretty handy. Oh, a bit of epic music. Funky rendition of that. I got that. I got pranas on my feet. Get off! Well, that was NG. What the hell is that?
Six more swings of this thing. Ooh. plant why are you sleeping potion there Kill these things? Because they are ruining me. Here you can. Right, so I have no idea where to go in yet. You can actually kill the boulders, okay? Oh, and you can. My energy's terrible. I'm going to die very, very quickly, I think. There's some bad lectors all doing this. Uh, I remember this boss. Just almost impossible to control him. You just got to keep whipping and hoping for the best. Last credit. Where is he? Oh great. I wanna go flying through him in. Come on, get off get off him. Change you got left as well. I'm not sure, but this might be the last level. That's a lot of eyeballs. Let's 
slowing down. That took a lot of energy off me. Ah. There you go. Right, guys, I'm going to call it a night for tonight. And I'll be back next weekend. And we'll uh, see what I fancy playing next weekend. So it's a fun little game, this is. It does play a bit janky. And uh, it does miss your inputs when you jump and stuff. Uh, but it does have nice music. It is quite a fun game. It's quite a quick game as well. It's quite cool, so maybe I'll try and finish this again. Right, anyway. Cheers for joining, guys. Hope you enjoyed yourselves. And have a nice week. I'll find my remote control so I can swap back to my PC. Cool. See you around.